What's going on guys, Challenge here, and today I want to make a video discussing, well, there's going to be plenty of videos today, Apex dedicated. Now this video is going to be talking about Revenant, the new legend. Now how is he, how is he performing, how do I think of him, do I like him, will I be continuing to use him? The answer is, he has basically become my second main. Now depending on how I feel, I'll be rotating Revenant and Pathfinder, but I just really, really love what this guy can do. He basically gives you a free opportunity to, you know, go in there, do damage, die technically, come back, heal, and go right back at them. And in many ways, it's really, really, really hard to deal with. Also, on top of that, he has a grenade that basically negates all abilities. And it's just really, really good. Now, full on, I'm going to give a little bit of a breakdown of what he can do. Now, Revenant is pretty much your traditional legend in terms of, you know, moving. But he has a few enhancements. Now, crouching, he can somehow you know i don't know what why but he crouch walks really really fast and really really quietly i don't know if the other legends do it as quietly i'd never really noticed on this but recently i've checked i crouched i'm like wow i am really really quiet and i feel like i'm lower to the ground maybe he has a lower you know maybe he's lower to the ground than traditional crouch uh players i don't know i haven't really checked that out i haven't really seen anything or tested that but yeah, possibility probably not though now on top of that, his his uh his grenade takes some finesse, but it can certainly be a big, big detriment to many legends in this game. Now legends like you know Bangalore, uh, Wraith, Pathfinder, Gibraltar, they suffer a hit from this guy. Pathfinder's whole you know idea is grappling, getting out of there, and when you strip him of that. It's an easy kill for the most part, as long as you're on point with your accuracy. Same thing with Wraith. Wraith, when you eliminate her passive ability, her passive te her teleportation ability, and her warp, uh, her um, portal, she cannot do anything. Gibbatar, same thing. If they have an alt that can save them, they're screwed. Bangalore, she can't even run out the situation. It's really, really powerful on you know countering one of the you know countering the most powerful legends out there you see on the field, especially in ranked. You know, quick play, you probably will see a little bit more different lower tiers of rank. You probably will see some other stuff. But when it comes to the fundamentals of what led people run as legend-wise, Revenant is a good counter to many of their abilities. Now, in terms of, like, cool, like, you know, how much it does, how long, I'm, I haven't really timed it, but it seems to be about, like, six seconds, six, seven seconds. It might not be too long, but if you're close enough and maybe your team needs some backup and you get a hit from across, it can do a lot of work and it just slows them down and they just can't move and you can get a better you could close the distance on them and do many other things and it has like a 16 second cooldown it's not really much cooldown it's, it's really good you can you know continually bring it back up and the alternate the alt is pretty good too it comes back fairly quickly now i wouldn't say maybe pathfinder quick but it does come back in a good amount of speed now breaking down is all it does need a little bit more detail than what is described. This has kind of been one of the most confusing things. How does it all work? Do you take damage? Do you not take damage? You do take damage. So when you are in this state, your shield is remains at where it was when you entered the state. And basically, you whatever damage you take is only to your health. Now, what this does is that you can go up there. You can follow up. You can heal real quick. And what and if judging the fact that, say, you did a shield and half their health, they're likely going to dedicate to a shield. You come back up, your full health and full shield potentially. Depends on when you time it. It does need some timing with your uh, coordination with your, you know, your other fellow squad mates. You know, if they're all full shield, you better off hopping L1, R1. They can obviously put more work in. If they have half a shield, they might be a little hesitant. But uh, it does good work. So you go back, very low health. You heal up. You go back up. You put in some more work. It's really, really good. But you do got to remember that when you place this, you do got to place it smart. You gotta hide it. It is like pretty much attack insertion in Call of Duty. They're gonna see it. They're gonna know you're gonna spawn there once they kill you. Now, will they do it? You know, will they get you? Depends how quick their reflexes are. More likely than not, they won't, especially on console where I play. You know, flicking onto that thing or at least finding and recognizing it when they start attacking is incredibly difficult. So I don't think people will do it. But overall, I guess I can rate this legend a eight and a half out of ten. Uh, he is fairly, fairly good. I'm loving every bit about him. He's bringing a different play style to Apex Legends that, you know, while I'm not as mobile, he his uh, climb ability I didn't really talk about, he does climb a bit further, like a, a good amount further than traditional Legends. So he can climb up 
you know, instead of climbing one wall, he can basically climb two and a half walls. Really good. It gets you to some spots faster and, you know, maybe if you're a Pathfinder main, you could check this guy out because you can do some stuff that you can't do as Pathfinder. Might not be able to move as fast and zip on across, but there is a little bit of a, you know, a give there. But yeah, that's all I got to say about Revenant. You guys, you know, check them out yet. I also got a sweet skin for him. I think I'll save my crafting materials because we got one of the legendary skins for him. The, uh, the Egyptian looking one, the bird one. It's awesome. I love it. And uh, in general, I, I'm loving this uh, new season so far. Uh, next video coming out is going to be talking about the map. What do I think about the changes? Does it feel better? Does it not feel better? Can Kings Canyon come back soon enough? But stay tuned for that. That should be dropping some point today. Sooner rather than later. And at the end of it all, we got a nice old gameplay of some stuff I messed around with. But until next time, guys, hope you guys have a good one. Subscribe for more Apex Legends gameplay news and as well as gameplays and news and all this other stuff from other games and reviews. But yeah, until next time, guys. Hope you guys have a good one. Shout out. Oh, whoa. Hope you guys have a good one. I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm tired as hell. Been playing. This is like 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm recording this. Challenge here, and I'm out. <laughs>